Okay, this is the reaction video to BlizzCon opening ceremony. We got quite some news about uh, Diablo, about Overwatch, about World of Warcraft. Not so much about Warcraft 3. Yeah, the news we got, um, which I guess is the most important one to us and we're gonna bring first. They're gonna announce the release date soon. And players with the virtual ticket here for yes. BlizzCon will get the beta, which begs the question, will the beta be available for guys who pre-ordered as well? Because that would be a little unfair if they give it to guys with a virtual ticket and not to guys who bought like the Spoils of War edition like a year ago, yeah. right after the announcement. So I guess we can s pretty much say that it's going to be a half open beta soon. Yeah, it must be. Anything else would seem very, very unfair. We also know that Warcraft 3 will be playable here. They haven't said exactly what the playable content is. We're all expecting it's just the beta build, so uh, 1v1 with Orc and Human. It's going to be down in the arcade area, which we're of course going to check out. Haven't been there yet, but will you bring more info on that as well soon? We heard yesterday from a source that the build here should be a little uh, newer than the one that we are able to play on the launcher. So we are a little excited about that. Hopefully a few graphics up Updates, hopefully a little bit more like color grading and all and we will stream here from BlizzCon but only one player will be able to stream so either we play a campaign mission like last time or we get matched against one of the guys on the floor yeah good question I don't know exactly how it's gonna work out but whatever it is we're gonna jump in there show you guys what we can show you and dissect it a little bit and perhaps try not to talk that much this time yeah exactly so, I'm really disappointed. I'm really disappointed and I can't really hide it. They didn't talk a lot throughout the entire year and everyone was looking toward BlizzCon, then they dropped the beta a week before. Yeah. And now they gave us nothing, like no, really not a specific panel during the open like last time, um, a little mentioning. That was all. Yeah. And that's not a good sign. Yeah, after that drought, a bit of disappointment is definitely to be expected. We, of course, have a panel tomorrow, which is going to be very, very interesting to follow, uh, which, of course, we're going to be doing. We're going to be bringing you the news. Um, yeah, what can we glean from this? What does that mean for the development of Reforge right now? Either it's not really ready or it's not a high-priority project at BlizzCon, uh, at Blizzard, which is both not good. Well, the remasters obviously um, have lower priority than the big uh, AAA titles. That only makes sense. But yeah, it is not what we're hoping for. Um, hopefully, day two will be able to make up for that. And perhaps we're going to find some other things here in the play area or whatever. Um, also, like the timing felt so weird. Like, right, uh, like last week, beta is announced. Imagine if in the opening here they say Warcraft 3 Reforged. You know, you guys, we haven't heard a lot anything from it, but... The yeah. beta is coming yeah. in two days or something like that. And then we've been like, yeah, nice, we're going to have the beta coming out. But no, it was a couple of days before. Really maybe weird it's, timing. Maybe it's timing issues for the presentation, but I think they went a little longer with the opening already. Yeah. So maybe that segment got scratched. There's rumors that it's uh, because of the uh, legal issues with... Uh, release and everything but whatever um, it is what it is we didn't get much in the opening unfortunately we were of course spoiled last year but yeah tomorrow we have a panel and we're gonna see what we see Ex uh, right <laughs> and we will keep you up to date on Twitter with uh, tweets of course and here on Instagram and YouTube and everywhere with uh, pictures and video content so hit the follow button ring the bell and do whatever you need to get notifications BlizzCon 2019 back to Warcraft coverage continues